We have all heard of the zombie apocalypse from television shows like Walking Dead and video games. And it's made people fear that one day this will happen to the world. If you don't know what I'm talking about, a zombie apocalypse is a viral disease that spreads across the world's population and people start turning into zombies or flesh eating monsters. In the early 2012, people started panicking because reports of individuals had become uh, becoming zombies or eating other people's faces. These people had zombie-like characteristics, but actually it comes from a drug commonly known as bath salts. Bath salts is a disease that messes with a person's physical and mental state, and horrifying things can happen, such as death. Most people don't know what bath salts are, what the effects are, or have not even heard the horrifying stories that people falling victim of this drug. So what are bath salts? Bath salts is a designer drug that is um, made to look like bath salts that someone uses in a bathtub, hence the name. Purple Wave, Red Dove, Blue Silk, and Zoom are some of the other names, street names of this drug. This drug is sold over the internet in crystal form, which this is what bath salts in the bathtub look like. Um, and it can come in many other forms such as capsules, powder, and tablets. It can be snorted, ingested, or swallowed. This drug consists of two major drugs, MDPV and methadrone. Both MDPV and methadrone are illegal in the United States, but bath salts uh, producers have made it so that bath salts is technically legal in the United States. Um, it's kind of crazy to think that something so dangerous can be illegal, but DA is trying to make it illegal, but more tests and studies have to be formed for it to do so. Since this drug doesn't have very many substances in it, you think that it isn't that, uh, wouldn't have that much effect on people. Well, you're wrong. Most times, the smallest things have the huge impact on life. There are many different effects of this drug that are dangerous and there's science to tell. Bath salts effect is such as methamphetamine, commonly known as ecstasy and cocaine, but are more intensified. <coughs> like many drugs, this bath salts is highly addictive, so I wouldn't suggest you do it. Some of the signs of someone who is on bath salts is paranoia, hallucinations, sign, uh, violence, or self mutilation So if you see anybody with these symptoms or signs, you should call the police and get them to a hospital. It's scary to see someone um, who is high on bath salts because it's said to have a zombie-like state. The major effects of this is cannibalism. Um, research aren't sure why people decide that they need to start eating other people but um, they think it's a mixture of this drug and other drugs, and it's highly dangerous. But not everyone turns into a zombie. And then according to Gateway Foundation, other effects are increased heart rate, flashes of euphoria, intense cravings, excessive sweating, and insomnia. These effects can last six to eight hours, but if you redose, it can last up to days. Since this drug is newer to society, they have not found all the health problems with it. But there are some, such as heart conditions and even worse, death. Natalie told you what bath salts are and the effects it has on a person. I'm going to tell you some horrifying stories of someone who has fallen victim to this drug. <clears throat> According to Los Angeles Times, over 2 million people use illegal drugs in the United States. Many different types of people use drugs, such as mothers, fathers, doctors, teachers, college students. Here's an example of a mother. This is Pamela McCarthy. She's a 35-year-old mom who one day decided to take bath drugs, or bath salts. Um, on her high, she, um, as you can see here, is naked. For some reason, they always seem to strip their clothes off when they're on bath salts. But she is chasing her, if you can see her three-year-old son, um, she wanted to rip his clothes off and eat him. Um, her, the guy holding her son is actually her boyfriend and the father of the son. Who um, He called the police and they were able to arrest her and they took her to a hospital and um, she ended up dying because of heart complications. So not all these people attack loved ones, but sometimes total strangers. <coughs> For example, this is a 65-year-old man whose face was eaten off by a man who was on bath salts. This is Ronald Popo. He was a homeless man in Miami, Florida, and one day his world was turned upside down. 
And this is 31-year-old Rudy Eugene, who approached Popo one day, where he proceeded to eat his face off. This attack lasted 18 agonizing minutes, and finally, until finally the police had arrived and shot uh, Eugene in the back. This is a picture of him, and this is actually the homeless guy. You can see the blood. Again, he's naked. Don't know why, but he is. <clears throat> so there's a lot of stories. Too many that I could find to put on here. So I'm sorry to inform you, but we aren't having a zombie apocalypse. Just people deciding to take really bad drugs that have really dangerous effects. I hope you learned something from, from these stories and you can take at least one thing away. And it, all I can say is please do not do this drug.